Okay, this video is dedicated to people who have the Nest thermostat who have issues with your Wi-Fi dropping out or if you get the low battery issue. Um, what happens is you got to go into your settings. This is how I fixed mine. Let's go into technical info. So you can see right there how I have it wired up now. But my battery says 3.9 and once your battery goes below 3.6 your Wi-Fi will drop out and you'll get the low battery alarm this is how mine is set up now but let's go look how my other one was set up if you noticed on the other screen I didn't have the 24V common hooked up so what happens is even though I had power which is on the bottom there it would only charge when the fan is running so if my heat wasn't going or my house wasn't cooling the battery wasn't charging so by hooking up to 24V common my system was able to charge full time now depending on your furnace it's either easy to hook up or it might be a little difficult but let's go downstairs and have a look at my furnace my furnace right here and the first thing we got to do is remove the cover the second thing once the cover is removed I know the electrical is behind this panel here, so let's remove it. So you can see right here, once I remove the cover, there's a safety switch right there, so it automatically kills the power. 24 common is the second wire down, and that's what I hooked up my orange wire to that ran into this red one. That in turn ran up to my thermostat housing. So once I connected that in, my power I never had that issue with the Wi-Fi dropping off or low battery because that way it's charging fully. Now if you're still confused, you can always open up your service manual or your manual that came with your furnace if you still had it. And look up the wiring and then be able to figure it out that way. If it, otherwise, if you have any other questions or comments, post them below. Otherwise, thanks for watching.